Dr. Joao Fernandez. He is a tribal rights activist. He is an author, he is a cultural activist and he has been championing tribal rights for the last 35 years. He wrote books, he is with, he's also a founder of Adivasi Sangatna, uh, Kepe. He's from Kepe, he's a practicing advocate. And with him we will explore the life of the early inhabitants of Goa, the Gaudas and Kumbis and how they were and what has come to the present status of them, how their, their rights-based issues and uh, their present status in our Goan society. I heartily welcome Mr. Joe Fernandez. Please. Expired. Then uh, 
blue color is being used. See, maroon color is this color is being used. And if a distant relative is expired, then maroon color is being used. So, in the tribal culture, or the, in the tribal dress code, as far as ladies are concerned, there is no space for black color. Now, that trend has been changed. This is the, this is the latest trend that has been gone up, that is not available. People feel shy to wear the dress, particular dress, so that they don't want to show that they are from the Gavada community. Because the reasons which I have mentioned first itself. Adivasis are nature worshippers. Live in close proximity with the nature. No statue worship. No symbol of statue at the holy places. Have changed with the influence of Brahminical people or Christianity. If we happen to any holy place of the tribals, including Man, you will find no statue. Catholic Gaudas are concerned. They used to keep a Divli in the middle only during the festival, either Dalu festival or during the truths. Otherwise, Man is an open space. No statue of any sort. Now, <coughs> tribal life in the circle. If you analyze the tribal life, circle has its own importance in the life of the tribals. Life is a circle. We start with cultivation which used to start in the month of March. That is soon after the Itruj festival is over. After the Itruj festival is over, they starts the sour cultivation, pruning the chakra jadmarap, nivadkarap, then uzgalap, magir, where they reside permanently, shatat tas karbaman, shat, दुआ मार्ग पर सब लोग काम करने शरण तले अनेक मई महीना चतम सब गल बजो मागिर तुगे सावरिक सांसों मतलब बजो मागिर तुगे ते गोड़ो पाकोर मारों यो अनेक मई महीना मई एंड ऑफ मई और बाय फिफ्टीन ऑफ मई चतम सब गल बजो शरण करो यू मे नॉट बी फैमिलियर विद द वर्ड्स आई एम यूजिंग सब ओ देन सावर देन आई � in my book, I have mentioned some of the, I have mean, given some of the meanings. Now, <clears throat> after the process of partition is over, they used to do weeding work, collect the firewood, but see, they have specific, in the month of August, or in the month of September, they used to collect the firewoods. And the significance is that, if they collect the firewood in this particular period, uh, the fire does not, the wood get, does not get affected. Then <coughs> harvesting so starts. Then, in order to glorify the Mother Earth for the harvest, our ladies used to play dalo. And dalo played either after, soon after the harvest season over, which means which starts in the month of October, first week of October, or second week of October, or sometime in the month of end of basically in the month of October. And <coughs> dalo song starts with dalo re dalo ambo kanu yari dalo ambo kan lari pikan chu rasho dalo re dalo ambo kanu yari dalo ambo kan lari pikan chu rasho it shows that if they play dalo then they get bumper harvest and this is the belief and dalo is played for 3 days 5 days 7 days 9 and 1 days Then cultivation of virus starts harvesting of sour, preparing the land for cultivation, then celebration of itruz. Once the sour cultivation is brought, then the itruz festival starts. And itruz festival now it is called as carnival. And itruz festival is being played by the gents. Woman has no role as far as Gauda itruz is concerned. Now some modification has been done. You want Ithrumaj. <coughs> now, <coughs> if you analyze or if you verify, man has a uh, man, man is the holy place of the tribes, has a shape of circle. 
household every every household and uh, this thing uh, has a courtyard and which is having a shape of round uh, all ceremonies performed on the mat or other pulpits by standing in a circle decisions were taken by standing in a circle while having the marriage food they used to sit in a round while giving blessing to the newly wedded couple they used to spread the food uh, food grains on the couple in a round shape while doing moiling they it used to be round keeping the hay in a round shape uh, now round symbolizes unity it symbolizes importance to community rather than individual it symbolizes democracy it symbolizes equality and no decision is being taken without hearing the affected parties without taking the taking or knowing the opinion of all the parties so <clears throat> even celebrations is being done by standing in circle so i came to the conclusion that the concept of democracy that that com com concept of liberty that the concept of unity might have been developed devolved from tribals now uh this is a photo they used to sit on the on the mashe for having the food at the very time the dress marriages function of the tribals i will focus on social political religious and cultural now <clears throat> they have a bond social bond to each other they live in cluster retaliation is not their nature they are most forest community helping each other now dress uh, uh, as far as dress is concerned i already mentioned about the now gents are concerned they used to have caste then banan now the dress code might have been changed and the for uh, for marriage they used to use the towel then the uh, towel sometime and some dress or shirt now as far as marriage celebrations concerned uh, prior to 1974 kaudas marriages were first performed on the bride side all the religious ceremonies even respect used to take place on the bride side but after 1974 they started from the bride groom side first after celebration of the marriage on the bride side then the second second day the celebration used to start on the bride groom side now there are certain ceremonies Uh, and marriages used to take place at the uh, bride was given in marriage at the age of 13 there is a court uh, on the second day upun uh, jamun katale the bride father used to give my hand over the her daughter to the bride groom or to the family member ani mutalo baro so pochile tero so tumko dile ताज तुम बर्ग सामा कर एक परंपरा आशी तीन बारह वर्ष पशिले तेरा वर्ष तुमको दिल ताज तुम बर्ग सामा कर देन द ब्राइड यूज टू क्राय देन द फादर यूज टू बी सैड एंड दे लाइक द चुटकी पेटी जाए दे यूज टू गो नाउ इवन देर वॉज नो सिस्टम रोज काड़प सिस्टम हम इतना आशि रोज काड़प सिस्टम इतने बी स्टार्ट सम फिफ्टीन एस बैक और ट्वेंटी एस बैक बट देर वॉज अ सिस्टम तेल चोड़ मेल चोड़ चोड़ खोबरे आनी पिटो घूम तेका जिड़े जिड़े बड़ी आसताली बाय वेंडा ये जो हमको घुमरा ताल आसता आनी ताल सगले जंट हाथ तक लगे रस्तर वो अभी परंपरा आई हजर की रोस काड़प हि जी सिस्टम जी तैयार ती मे बी रिसंट मे बी इवन माय यूथफुल डेज आई हेव नॉट नेवर सीन रोस काड़ so rose is not recently maybe a uh, copy of other culture now you want there was no practice of dowry dowry system might have been introduced globally uh, in fact 
the bridegroom or the the boy used to help the bride if their financial condition very poor. There was no system of dowry. Bride price. That is a bride price, like it amounts to a bride bride price. What is it? Bride price. No, because uh, if the condition of the bride was poor, then the family of the boy used to help in terms of food grain. <laughs> now, <coughs> language is concerned. Tribal has Gauda particularly have a unique dialect. Uh, now, if if you do not take care of preserving this dialect, it will be a great loss to our dialect, to our Kokni language. Now, Aap, uh, Aoi, An, uh, then Sates, in some cultural folk dances, you will find Sate, then Rohiva, in S. S is the various uh, celebrations to welcome the newly wedded couple. S is Rohiva, then Tere is there, Tere means festival. Uh, in folk dance, in Dalu festival. Now, uh, everyone has a photo 
also called as Vartan, and in some way, then female is called the Vartan. Administration was done by the Buddhon or Vartan. Decisions are taken under his leadership command. All ceremonies of the world that perform to him uh, on the man, now called Lady Foundation Store, before New House. Though the decisions were taken in construction with the in construction with the great elders, Dajan, uh, also Dajan, they are known as Pogre. So there were certain families in the world who were known as Pogre. And they were the part of decision taking body. Budwan was on the final. Uh, even in cultivation, now someone cultivation the Padam is out of the Padam. Dajan Sama Padila Sai, that are at the Buddha even in the petty field, if there are uh, 10 components or 6 components, one was the board. Who used to do, who, who used to take the leadership? Management was done by two people. Now, Budwan is hereditary. Rare cases, the Budwan was changed. He goes against the blood capable or woman goes against uh, the interest of the world, then Budwan was changed. Otherwise, no. Now, religious, they believe in what? Radha and Krishna. Because of this belief and with their hard work, they have developed government. Even most of the roads in Goa, everybody has to agree that most of the roads in Goa were developed by the daughters. They used to stay outside the house for, for days together. Even uh, in Pedne, uh, then uh, in uh, Mapsa. They the contractor to hire them, they used to reside over their form fix and these roads have been developed by most of the governors. Nature of all the worshippers. Uh, every household is having a pool table. My pool table is Malkarjwan. Now some of them may be called as Malikarjwan, but at the time, Karan Maran and Karan Maran, Karan Maran 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 Magir to the Banal Dawam, Ashkurun, Kadan Nordale, Ani Kaza Dalmati Magir de Nidale. Magir Pila Gadi Gadi for a second important role as a legacy. So much in the board burn up, the trouble is very good. Adam Kaikaran, get him to Gadia Burna, Gadi Burna, Pun Kayam Kale, to see Bola Havili, Kangaranikala, Thore Ashivadas, Gadi Burna. But if Gadi has an important role in the life of the tribals, so much, it is called witchcraft. Uh, and if you have a little bit of a gadi, they used to consult the Gadi, Prasadla, Panikya, Sakala, 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 Sakala. Witchcraft would be a loaded word. No? Pardon? Witchcraft would be a loaded word. Now it is a loaded word, but Gadi is a common word. And then, there is a Bantin. Bantin is a lady. And if Gadi is a gent. अनेक किधर समाज प्रसार पर लाभ आता है अतः हम बाकी के आउट पेट बिल्कुल आया था आउट दिए पड़ा मां गाड़ा पे गाड़ा पे रूप आओगे के लिए अनेक किधर रूप में के लिए अनेक बाकी रे समाज कौन से समाज वाइड स्पीड बदला दलेर गाड़ा पे लोग सब बाकी रिवांड गाड़ा पानी के लिए अनेक किधर चकरा दाता है अतः � जालर रोड गाता ले, अनि रोड गलता ही था, अनि रोड कौन गाऊंगा आदमी तो कल अब आम समय साढ़े बीता रहना का, जालर तीन जो गाऊंगा रहा साथ देखे आदमी तो ले रोड गलत, मागे रामी शैतान समझ फुल्ली की मुन्दा ले फुल्ली, फुल्ली तो रोपा फुल्ली, मागे नोपा फुल्ली कहने की दे, रोड तो कल रोड कलम में कल टूटा रोड तक ले फक्त स्वरास्तलों माया जैन दुष्ट आस्तले कितने हाथपान आस्तले कुछ मसाली कितने शिन रोड कलम ले दुष्ट आस्तले अरे बाकी जो आस्तलों अतः there are two speed one is 
good spirit and one is bad spirit in the tribal theory. Devuncha Raghanda, Mada Guru, Apsi, Jagya Dhani and there are some others good spirit. Bad spirit, Bhut, Alvatin, Vargatin are some of the uh, bad spirit. Now basically Devuncha is for the tribals, he is the protector, he is the Rakanda. And he used to protect the entire world. He used to protect the pedophile. He used to protect the sour cultivation. And if rot is the ceremony performed to glorify or to pacify the Devansari. Concept of God might have been lately developed, maybe influenced with the other religious. Then, <coughs> For the protection of cattle, he used to perform matam, matam is the one ceremony. Then, uh, uh, if, a, if a person came in contact with evil spirit, Bhut Pishama Lali Dala, Taka Magir Ghadi used to play the role. Magir Taka Iwani Kadam Dadali. So, it was suggested what item to be given at the time of Iwani. Uh, it was suggested by the Ghadi. Or burnt in. Mangi, if a person is expired, then Uri Karapunadale, Ani, decided by the Gadi, advice is taken from the Gadi. Or Mangi, Tin Sangari Belmont, she gets a Sudamunadale, something either kicking crop, Mangi the Gardner or crop, a shake, Sudamun Karapunadale. Now, economy. Uh, every village was self-sufficient because they would cultivate it. Uh, they were the best agriculturist. Now they have good habits. Rice, then ambi, then pakot, oro, nasmi, kango. Uh, Staple diets were rice and ambi. You want as a substitute curry, as a substitute curry, they used to use ambi. But sometimes curry was not available. Family condition was poor, so they used to uh, use ambi. Now, scientifically, it is proved that ambi is one of the best food, rich in nutrients, nutrient, and good for health. Now, they used to do agriculture at the place where they were permanently settled. But sour cultivation was practiced. Sour means they used to clean, they used to put the forest, they used to clean up the forest, burn the clean area, then spread the either pakol or gode over it. So, sour is cultivated in the forest area. <coughs> From one song, I can make out that sour cultivation continued till 1979 or it is because only once I have been to a to a our goal for sour cultivation. Uh, now <coughs> to reside at the sour, if there are ten component, they used to raise a tent of around 15, uh, 20 to 50 meters length, and all the families during harvesting or during the uh, sowing operation, they used to reside in the, called gold. The tent is called gold. Then, for guarding the sour cultivation, they used to raise tent. Now, in the deep forest, uh, if the area is around 10 hectares or 5 hectares, 5 to 6 people used to guard during night time. Only during, uh, when, the, when the crop gets uh, ripe, that time only they used to guard, otherwise they chose to protect. Then raising cattle, not for commercial purpose, but only for agriculture. Now, such type of tent where the custom may be around uh, 20 to 50 meters in length, all the families to reside, such type of tent. These are photo I get uh, around uh, 2018, I have clicked some at Mayana. This is a Malo, they used to reside during night time. 
Now, you uh, may agree or not, but Gaudas were one of the best engineers. Expert in their own field. Used to prepare all the instruments required for the village. Like rafter, patio, plow, nangar dar, or nangar piece dar, magir zoo dar, magir tvele san dar, mal dar, sel dar, ton ban pak, magir daim dar, gora ban pak, magir daun dar, gora ami, ya moini kal pak, magir adam, Construction of the Gelo, Dunit Manpa, they were the best expert. Market Kapi Hood, road construction. Every village was having the required manpower. Mess the carpenter, the Sidamale, normally mess, and a carpenter, the town Kumbar, the Afri community such as Nashile. Poor Gamakati, the special term Katale, I'm getting a mess as you know. That market in Chan was not a son of a Madillo. अनेक मुंडे किस अपार्ट फ्रॉम सोमेल पुष्टि कर पाते हैं मेस दर जो लो कुंभार दर मागेर कार्पेंटर दर ये आम चीज़ समाधान चोर शासन आशील है अनेक आसान आशील है दूसरी पिचान दरी आड़ अनेक जो कुंभार आसान तो जो इन रॉ मटेरियल में डा माइट दिखेल तो अंडर तार दर मात दर तीन राव तलो मागेर दुगेर तो एक साइडी अनेक चौड़ सी सोमलंद के लिए जो बुधों का साथ तय करा साइडी नस्तर चौड़ चलो बाकी वही जो नस्तर है वही जो वही जो मिला आपके बाइंडिंग अदा डिलीवरी कर पाक अनेक सामान्यतः मैं एक्सपर्ट चौड़ सी लेडीज़ नस्तर है वही जो बाकी सबसे पहले एटलिस्ट गांव के एक चार पांच जोड़ ल मुदा फादर लाइक इधर बजे हैं मागेर तुझे पटान दुख जाए किधर बजे हैं मागेर तुझे ले सो बच जीरो जाए ना किधर बजे हैं युवान ना मार याद आता कि मुझे बारिक पुरी बारिक अस्तर ना आमी दुखते हैं पालों कसन आड़ अने माटो पानी कुत्तों पड़ा मलाओ बड़ी बड़ा ताले ठंडी तरह किधर सब लेते नॉल मोड़न मस्त है मोड़न मिला रहा मोड़न आपके समझ आता है शिल्प पूर्ण मोड़न जी डिलीवर जाल मटर जी दो पाँच एक काम तीन मोड़न करता है नाउ कल्चर तो गाउडा स्पेयर एकोनॉमिक पूर्व दे में कल्चर बीच नाउ वन दे एग्री और वन आवर प्रिस्ट विल नॉट एग्री that they have destroyed the mind, but it is the church or it is some of the office who have destroyed the mind and they have destroyed our rich culture. It is a place for cultural performance. Mind is the place for cultural performance. Destruction of mind lead to destruction of the entire culture. Importance decision were taken at the mind. And as I have already stated that nobody dare to go against the decision taken at the mind and it is the best system for giving justice to the village. Maybe I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do. It has an effect. Maybe I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do. Dalo is being played by women, while Itru is played by men. And this Dalo or Itru is to glorify the mother earth for the harvest. Now these are some of the, these are the Dalo photo, these are Itru celebrations. These are some of the folk dances, these are the Itru mix photo. These are some of the Manda Akhirgachi, then this is Dwane. Cultural approving of the travels by Portuguese government and the church. Now, due to the influence of the church or Brahmanic religion, in our culture, Pandavas came inside. There is one Soron called glorifying Pandavas, one Soron called glorifying Jesus, then some of the songs related to Ram, 
Uh, see, uh, this may be the influence of change in religion. Uh, then one Choron is glorifying sister and brother. The Choron glorifying Jesus goes as under. Kitwa Swamin Akwar Mariba, Kitwa Swamin Akwar Mari, Akwar Marikushi Jezal Malaba, Akwar Marikushi Jezal. It narrates the entire history of Jesus. How, how came I? Who has preached them? I don't know. Uh, now, Mar has been destroyed. It's an important, significant, significant, important institution of the tribes. Was destroyed by calling it devil place. Uh, now, in old conquest, Man might have been destroyed long back, but in our village, I have witnessed complete destroyed somewhere in the year 1997. And I have started writing or collecting the folk dance, folk songs in 1993. Otherwise, uh, I also the entire tradition or the folk songs or the folk dances would have been lost. Now, uh, they could destroy because Kaulas were voiceless and powerless. Otherwise, they would have not. Because in some of the places, uh, is still what our church calls this devil glorifying is still going on. Uh, now, in place of mine, crosses have been, cross have been built up. And they have been built up right in the center. So even we don't have place to gather. And in the month of October, we used to play Dalo. Now prayer service has been introduced by the church to pray on the month in the month of October. Whole month. We used to play either five days, seven days, or eleven days. But whole month prayer is going on. <coughs> now a question comes to my mind. This question again and troubles me. Whether Gaudas were landless labor. If they were landlords who had taken their land, what church has done to protect their land? Now, how can people from Marga, Mapsa, or Penjim become the landlord? in Kepe when they were not residing there. Now, oh, I have learnt that in my Amal village, there are two communities residing. Majority are Christian Gaudas and other side of Gangas are residing. They are still original land landlords, their names are figuring. They are owning land as original landlords, but Kaudas, no. Recently I came uh, a document wherein a name of one Catholic Kauda, name is Pahlikar Rebelo, is figuring, but subsequently one Furtat or one Kutino has purchased his land portion. So nobody from the Kauda communities is shown as original landlord as one did. So, if they were landlords, then who had taken their land? What made them to be bankrupt to lose their land? And from one of the Goa University professors, I have learned that now celebration is celebrations. Kathleen and Kelly, if you have a family, you can't get 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 a family, he became bankrupt, then entire land goes. But how far it is true? Maybe it can be true. There may be some evidence. Without evidence, we cannot make such a statement. So we are nobody is shown as a uh, original landlord now. Now, uh, tribes look down upon a second-class citizen by the church authorities. Now, church promotes that. Church is casteless. There was no casteism, all are equal. But still, casteism is there in the church. It is, they could not destroy casteism or could not finish. If you go to the Holy Spirit Church, still there is casteism. 
and casteism is being promoted or preserved through the confraria. Uh, in Margao, in one church, Holy Spirit Church, Gaudas has a separate confraria, Brahmins has a separate confraria, and other communities have separate. There are three confrarias. And on the Good Friday, the Gaudas are not allowed to touch the statue or take part in the profession. What they are not allowed to fold the uh, all the statues of the Jesus. So, casteism is still there in the church, and we are a second class citizen. Still, white collar untouchability is existing in the church. Church may say anything because I have experience. I have written to the authority of the church that to hear the issues on tribal issues, they let us give appointment. They are not ready to give any appointment. So it shows that uh, tribals are second class citizens. They are slaves for them. And so slave or untouchables cannot have any issues. That may, I, now, as far as education is concerned, church has done commendable job in the field of education, admitted. But the villages where predominantly Gaudas were residing, they have not started a single school. I have, I have noticed in entire or Goa. Forget about high schools. Not even primary school they have not started. Now in Amalin, 95% are Gaudas. The school was not started. Even primary school. After liberation, the schools were started in Amalin. Now in the nine, 2000 years, 2000, uh, 2000, they have started some uh, Sisters have started school. Even the, in the areas where Gaudas are predominant, in Sanjuri area, in the late 1990, some of them have started schools. But basically, the schools were started by the government, not by the church, where predominantly Gaudas are residing. Uh, uh, so, to uplift the Gaudas as a community, in the field of education, in the field of social, and in the field of economic, they are very limited. Now, as far as church is concerned, they have done some favor on us, admittedly. They have maintained our birth record, they have maintained our death record, they have maintained our marriage record. And if our birth and death is not recorded, then our turn also would have come to end, to go into the detention camp. If the new CA came into force, our, our turn along with our other tribal fellows, our turn also would have come to enter into the detention camp because we would have not any document. My father was born in 1946. My grandfather was born in 1936. My great-grandfather was born in 1887. Uh, Prior to that, I could not locate the birth certificate. And the funny part is that we are called as Gaudas. Our community is identified as Kunbi. Even our Sari is called as Kunbi. Our uh, cultural dance as well could be dance. But my father's birth certificate, my mother's birth certificate, it is recorded as Kurumbi. C U R M R U M B I. Kurumbi. Now, uh, even, even now, why I am saying that we are considered as a second class citizen, even by the church authorities who has brought us to the new fold. In some of the Dyson school, for being a Gauda, we are not giving admission. Their condition is that their standard will go down. Reservation policy is not being implemented properly. In the as far as giving admission in the school institution and institutions are concerned. Though they take the benefit of Padrat which is uh, which far food for which is being used from the tribal department. <coughs> Consciousness of right and duties. Now <coughs> suddenly maybe to widen the ideologies or to propagate the ideologies, Kaudas are conscious of religiously conscious, but uh, they are rarely conscious of their rights and duties. They are rarely conscious of their constitutional rights. Uh, now we have to admit that one of the indisciplined community 
in the whole society is around us. We have to admit. And as a result, you will find more drunkard will be in our, from our community, young widows will be from our community. Now, because of young widows, so many social problems, so many economic problems which is being faced by my community. Now, there is a tribal cell in the, in the church, but it is being, uh, not being a functioning. Uh, you want, you want remote areas, some of the solution are functioning, but not with the whole heartedly to uplift the drivers, but they, are, they may be having their own intention to increase their number or to uh, focus on their ideology. Unemployment is rampant. Uh, some of our youths have taken the opportunity to go into the country uh, and improve their economic standard. Some of them have taken benefit of observation, but it is sad to note that those who have taken benefits of observation hardly look back at the community. As far as others are concerned, Vili and Gaukar, they have no escape. They, they have to show that from the island, from the surname also they can make out that they are from particular community. But as far as Catholic are concerned, uh, our surname is some of them, Fernandes, Rebelo, Miranda, Kutino, even. So, we cannot be identified that we are from a particular Gauda community. So, those who have taken benefit hardly look back at the community. The intellectuals, those who have come up, financially come up, hardly look back at the community. So, community suffers. And uh, whom to blame? Because of this stigma that the Gaudas are drunkard, uncultured, barbaric, Nobody want to remain with the community of intellectuals. Now, even uh, from uh, uh, church hardly stands with the community. Uh, now, in 18, uh, 1990, uh, so motto was issued by the government to uh, declare the to implement the tenancy act, but hardly there was any. Any awareness made by the church, maybe the church is one of the biggest landholders in Goa. Uh, did not support any of the tribal men. In 2001, we were fighting for uh, tribal status, but there was no any input from the. Then even now we are fighting for reservation, uh, assembly reservation, political reservation. There is no support from the church for the tribals. Now, uh, Blaming others will not solve the problem. We have to blame ourselves. Because we are failing because we don't have a powerful neutral organization. Now, even Catholic Gaudas were having their own organization. First, it was it was Gauda Vikas Mandal, then Mulgakara's report. When when the organization started flourishing, they merged with the political party. So the interest of the community. Uh, getting compromised. Uh, now, as in 2003, though we, have, we were declared, three communities, Gauda, Vedic and Kuntis, were declared as scheduled tribe. They are act to get the constitutional rights. Uh, reservation policy is not being implemented. Tribal advisory council is not being formed by the government. Uh, Reservation under section 330 and 330 is had to be given, which are fighting for. Then scheduled areas are not yet notified. Uh, then tribal tribal supply fund is not being given properly. If it is given also partially and it is not being implemented. So basically tribals, what they were supposed to get, they are not getting. And they are being uh, justice being denied to the drivers. So, as I already mentioned, that uh, blaming others will not solve the problem. We have to take the lead. And if drivers want to come up in life, or they they want to shine, the tribal intellectuals 
have to come out, have to form organization. Uh, they should be be with the community, work for the community, and then only the community can come out. Uh, once again, again I thanks uh, Goa Museum for giving me an opportunity. I don't know how far uh, I am able to impress upon you. I don't know. But uh, I have done my level best to share my history. As far as marriage is concerned, I can talk for one tribal niche, I can talk for half an hour. One tribal culture also, I can talk for half an hour. But uh, as just 45 minutes, I have gone, I completed in the most uh, uh, 60 minutes. Am I right? Uh, okay, uh, thank you. I again thank you. Thank you. So, now uh, the forum is open. You can ask the questions, no issue. What is the total population of uh, Gauda Valley Pinkun Base in Goa? Uh, we are of uh, 10 as per the 2011 census. We are uh, 10.23. Now there are, you see, in uh, when 2001 census was done, we were almost 12.5 percent. Now we are, as per the 2011 census, we are 10.23. The reason I tell, uh, <coughs> initially we were in OBC, then subsequently we are included in ST in 2003. Uh, while notifying or registering themselves, some of them have registered as OBC, it's not as broad as ST. Particularly, particularly in Satsit. I don't know because of the stigma or because of sinus. As a total result, total number of MLAs. Total number of MLAs as on date there are four MLAs. One is Atom Mals, then is Gold yeah. Gaudi, um, Ramesh Tarodar, and Ganesh Nagar. Four MLAs. As far as uh, Gauda community are concerned, Atom Mals. Exact ten percent. Pardon sir. Exact ten percent. Ten percent. Four hundred forty. Ten percent. Admitted. But uh, they, they are uh, not elected from this category. So they are from general. We, so we are we supposed to get 10% reservation, four seats, but we are not getting. In spite of completion of four, four, 20 years, in other states they have given, but in Goa, uh, we are being denied. Is the population spread out all over the state or is there some belt? No, or it is spread even in North Goa, we have sizable population. Even in, uh, I was uh, verifying, even in uh, Saligao constituency, uh, there are sizable Gauda population migrated from South Goa. Even Kalambut, Saligao, Mapsa, town also there is sizable population of Gaudas. Even in Kurka, uh, there is sizable population. There is sizable population. Even in the Kumbar Zoa, that side there is sizable population. The Christian Gaudas, I'm talking about. Most of them migrated from South South Goa. Even the our old Goa, that island, uh, Divar. There are Catholic Gaudas. You mentioned in your last point as a solution that maybe forming a, an organization, an impartially neutral organization, might help to solve the problems. So. Is someone trying to form such an organization? See, now, to get the political reservation, we have formed mission political reservation for Shadow Tribe for Goa. Let us see, uh, the youths are taking the leadership, and I am positive, optimistic that uh, uh, when the need arises, I am optimistic that in any village, Kincha Gawant, Kincha Deshan, Kincha Samadhan, when need arises, such type of people are born, they become leader and they take up the issues. In tribal community also, such people will, will born, will be leader and they will take up the issues of the tribals. That is full faith I am having. I don't know when it will happen, I don't know. But uh, see, when, when uh, intellectuals in the Ambedkar need was there, Ambedkar came in life, Ghainar was there, then Swami Kananda. So that is the natural process to take place. You are playing Gaurda somewhere that the Gaurda community is indisciplined. What do you mean to say indisciplined? Why do you say they are indisciplined? Socially. 
So shall we see now if you verify death due to alcoholism most in our community. Socially in this we are talking about due to excessive drinking most death is from my community. Figures are high. Figures are high. Uh, even in Ambavali now, now the rate might have been decreased to some extent. But death in Ambavali just due to alcoholism from my community. And young death between, uh, between 30 to 50. Very pathetic. If you go through the uh, entire world Goa, where the Gaudas are residing, most death are due to alcoholism. That could have some correlation with poverty also, no? Certainly no. Certainly no. But uh, there are some other issues also. Poverty, you see, we were not poor. A person who feel like to work, there is a lot of work. See, during my youthful days, in my entire ward, maybe there are hardly two or three people who were ex excessive drinkers. But, and they were disciplined. My grandfather was a disciplined person. He used to have a drink, but uh, during, uh, while having his meal, while having his dinner, otherwise no. Very disciplined. But now our youths are basically disciplined. As far as drinking is concerned. And that has resulted in creating a lot of problems to our community. Drinking per se, in my opinion, is not for any community. In over drinking, you take at any level alcoholism. At, in any religion, the alcoholism is very high. In so I, I don't think it's only for daughters. My opinion. No, you are. You may be right, but death. If you analyze the death due to alcoholism, mostly from our community. There, there could be something. There could be something because if you look at drug taking, for example, when we were young, it was mostly a Catholic middle class habit. Today it has gone to Hindu Bhaujans and you know, it seems to be shifting the impact of it. I don't know that what is the connection. This one also. But there's one thing on the uh, percentage of rivals in Goa, where you said you have taken 2001 census and 2010 census and you have come to 10% 10, 10 or whatever. But the actual tribal percentage at the time of liberation was 33%. So you have, to, you have to highlight no, that I, issue. No, you so you want to say tribals have got diluted because of migration of other people into Goa. So, even then, even then, what I feel that our percentage is not 10 percent. It should be more than 50 percent, 15 percent at this, at this center. Uh, most of the people in Sunset have not registered themselves as tribals. Even in Marma Goa, even in those who are residing in the in the North, North Goa, they have not registered themselves as uh, tribals. They have registered themselves as OBC. So the percentage of population, these are the, some of the reasons. Because some of the officials who were conducting the population survey, census survey, has informed me that people from Sunset are not coming forward to register themselves as tribals or governors. Because maybe because of shyness, I don't know. Since the tribal is nature worshippers, they were not exactly in the Hindu fold, Brahminical Hinduism, neither Christianity. How do they respond? the present Hindutva agenda of the ruling party. Now, see, uh, Gaudas following Catholic faith, they feel good to identify themselves by religion other than community. So, they mostly identify themselves as Catholic. Similarly, our Hindu tribes, they identify themselves as as Hindus rather than a uh, very counter. And uh, even, uh, even due to influence of the Christianity and uh, Brahmanical religion, uh, all the cells, there is vast change in the ceremonies performed by the Hindu tribals, Catholic tribals also. But now nowadays they are becoming conscious that they don't have any religion. They are nature worshippers. Very little has been written on it. Can you uh, mention some of the books that have come no, out? No, I could not because uh, I could not find any. I have not even what I have delivered, what, what I have spoken. I have not referred any book. It is my own experience. Uh, I find could not find any book written on the social life 
religious life or economic life of the tribals. Uh, if you are having any information, you can share. I can go through the information, but uh, so far, and uh, perfect information can come forward. Uh, books written or information shared by the person from that community, because uh, the the information which is being given by others is being so taken from someone else. So it cannot be perfect. What I feel. Goa University, you mentioned when uh, you said a professor from Goa University yes. works on, on these issues. No, he, he has informed me. Ah. Who is uh, he? Alito Sikira. Alito. Alito. Uh, and as far as land, we were discussing about land. Amin in Kirgaon, the land, Ladin Karbatalu, Kaplan Jodi. Anik Atmun to Sagala Gaon Karda, that may keep the Karda alone. I think it involved a lot of expenses. So, this might have resulted in anik do padri samanta yer bis lagun padani this might have resulted in bankruptcy of the among the tribals or the or the influential families of the tribals which might have been resulted in losing their land see now in ambauli village uh, there are cool days from some of their cool days as parvat amke chandra chandreshwar budna our cool day is kanpan amalka zone some of them are from Norway, then some of them are, some of their cool names, Zamaoli, they are Nesai Kar, they might have migrated from Nesai or some of them are known as Mordoka. Now, <coughs> those who are original from my ward or Ambauli, they should have their land, but nobody is having the land because their cool name is Chandreshwar Bhutnath Parvat, which means they are from their own land. So, nobody is having. So, even now, recently I learned that uh, I came in possession of that document. Uh, one Balikar was having land, but uh, it was also gone. Now our uh, Kankar is having land, still they are owning land as their condition, our condition is almost same. But we could not hold any land as owner. However, the government and many other organizations are trying to promote the Kundi Sari, sell it. Do you think there's any benefit in doing that? See, the community? Uh, basically, these Saris were owned by our community. Yes. There is no dispute as far as our community is concerned, wearing of the Saris is concerned. But now in Goa, when you say that, you to say that, you can say that, you can say that, you can this concept is still, is still, it might have been reduced to some extent. But even even I was when I was studying, I have I have come across this thing. So I have been mentally humiliated. Even the church, I have been mentally humiliated on this issue. Uh, so this might have been the reason why people are still having the Kundi Sari. So when when uh, you are being uh, humiliated, then nobody wants to show that they are from communities. As a result, even now, now we we have. By organizing tribal festival, while reviving some of the provinces, we managed to revive the sari also. I have collected around 20 saris. I have got around 20 different colors. Uh, now it is a good sign, but uh, the revival will not benefit the community. They will not benefit the community because uh, unless and until it is being used on a large scale, uh, then uh, it, it, it may revive because only these saris being Festival time, otherwise, no. Actually, Kodubi is now in answer to Sari. There is a whiskey also. Whiskey is promoting in the Kodubi. So, which is more for Now, few days back, I was there at Angola. And we happened to visit one Kundi village. Even Saris from Goa. Saris from Goa were supplied at Angola. Now, as far as we used to purchase the Sari during marriage festival. Around dozens of saris we used to purchase from Afsa, Pastora. And this trend continued uh, till uh, 1990s. When I, my mother was wearing a Kundi Sari uh, when I was studying in uh, Dyson School. I was hesitating to take my mother uh, when we are having parent teacher meeting because, see, then when we were studying in the school, they were if, when something wrong happened with us, they would call it ah. ah. So 
in order to that's don't do not to show that we are from a particular community. I used to some, take someone else. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, uh, okay, <coughs> just a minute. Sit up to me. See, you said your mother's surname or grandfather's surname was Kurumbi. No, not surname. They are tribe. Tribe. Right, tribe. So that Kurumbi could be actually the link to Orissa and that where, from where the tribals have come. But uh, see, uh, the... I have translated the birth certificate of my great grandfather, mm -hmm. which is of 1889. But uh, in that birth certificate, the tribe is not mentioned. Now I want to get the birth certificate of my grandfather to verify whether uh, what is mentioned in his birth certificate. In my great grandfather birth certificate, the tribal is not mentioned. Maybe it's quite possible because all tribal have links. We are from migrated from that. This thing not not India. Yeah. Sir, in your presentation, no. the word "mand" is often used. Can you explain the? and what uh, cultural practices happened earlier and now? See, <clears throat> as far as Gauda Mans are concerned, presently, except few, none of the mans of the Gauda are functioning. It has been destroyed, it has been finished. In place of the mans, uh, cross has been built up. It has been projected every place, so nobody wants to go at a devil place. And nobody, you also not will not go when it is projected as a devil. Now, mind where use is a, is a powerful institution of the tribals. Important decision for the better of the mind, for praying, for cultural performances like Dalo, Idruz, Idrumej. These were the important uh, festivals were played. And during Idruz festival and Dalo festival, the mind is giving different uh, attire. Even at that period, they were considered as holy place. We have, we never used to go with our boots or uh, sandals on the mud. So some abstract forms are there, and local people call them as a mind. Mind means yeah. see, mind is a is a place for gathering. Manda wale, rapa mind. See, there are mind, rapa mind, magir, bagel mind, manda wale. So, mind is a gathering place locally. Certainly. Just the role of language in uh, shaping our understanding. Okay, sometimes the biased role. To give pardon, sir, pardon. the role of language in shaping our understanding. Okay. To give two examples, uh, we take this word called gadi. And we translate it as witch doctor. It sounds very something very uh, nefarious. Actually, it is more like a, a priest of the tribal religion, uh, maybe a shaman or a, a priest of the little tradition, if you want to call it that. Uh, this same, same thing of the word dyaotsar. Okay, for an average Catholic, the word dyaotsar equals to devil. For for you, it means something totally different. It is a it is a spirit who may be benevolent or malevolent either one who has to be placated but is like you know it's like it's like a, reli a religious belief so while mistranslating these words that's why where the confusion starts and it's carried on so then it becomes devil worship is it now, right now you even in bible you will not find devsar you will find, find satan even devsar word is derived from two words devane yeah correct correct now see correct if if you want to impose your culture on me, yeah. or if you want to impose your ideology on me, yeah. then you have to destroy my ideology. Yeah. So same thing happened with the yeah. tribal religion also. In order to impose the ideology, in order to impose the religion, they have to play on this. There is some misunderstanding which may be deliberate also. Deliberate. Which, yeah. Even this this happened. I have mentioned my book. Uh, who are the priests responsible for destroying our culture, our mind? Kuncha Mula, I mentioned their names. How they played a role. It is in 2000, uh, 2000, uh, 90, sorry, 1997. If they could destroy, or if they could do so in, in democracy, or when we are governed by a constitution, where tribes are given special 
protection. How how they played a mischief in the during their regime. Them they are the walking like dictators. To get Bharatiya Garbana, the Kadar Garbana, to get Mwarni Garbana, to get Bidar. Suddenly they, they bow. But do you see this as a problem of individuals or an institution as a whole? Institution. See, without dictates from the institution, individual can't work. That's what I want to notice. Because they may be having instruction from the institutions. Because it is a, it is a collective decision, suddenly. What is the role of the man now in the Hindu goddess? So <laughs> in the Catholics, it is gone. It is gone. There are some. There are still some. Among the Catholics, there are some. But initially, every ward was having a man. When there were dispute among the tribal clan, they used to set up different man. As per my knowledge, there are functioning some of man. A uh, Hindu man, uh, there is an influence of Brahmanical religion. Now, they have been concretized. Some structure has been done. I have been someday. I have been to Delhi. They have they have constructed. The, they have covered the man. Uh, one day it will be transformed into a temple. Like government one day it will transfer into a chapel. Huh? I think so. Like construction. But no. the Shikali, Shikali, Dalu koi jata no. Mada sir, 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 Mada Mand is restricted to Gaudas because I have heard of Baga and places like that having a man till the 60s, 70s if I remember right. Of Gaudas? No, no, not Gaudas but other communities like fishing communities. They were having the man, you want Bandar Sahib having the man. Even the Kharvis I think have a man because two words that he used there. Uh, are also found in Kharvi language. Uh, the hmm. lady, head lady, the words they use, tell no. Vardkan. Vardkan. They are today. Vardkan. They call them as Vardkan. 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 It is. Vardkan. Vardkan. Am Vardkan. Mandal. Vardkan. Vardkan. But Proof. Kharvi use for that. Yes, Bauja Samaj it is there. In Bauja Samaj it is there mostly. Hmm. Mand is there. Professor Dennis has done his PhD on the uh, Gauda dialect of Kokni. Professor yes. Dennis of Goa University. Uh, I think uh, Father Agnel's college or something. Yeah. yeah. Recently, very recently. The dialect of Yeah, dialect. Gauda dialect of Kokni. Okay. But is it possible that you had a pre Kokni language? Because Kokni is Indo Aryan for that. Also. Why it is called dialect, I don't understand. It is actually it is not dialect, it's the it language. Has been yeah. By yeah. Yeah. Other but people. in place of the Aryans. Huh? By the interest of the It's very much yeah, a dialect. A dialect, a dialect with, with an army is a language. A dialect with an army becomes a language. That's all. So there is no clear dividing line. What is a dialect? It all depends on definition, I but guess. But if you listen to their language, the Okni language which they speak here, especially Kanpon and those areas, it's quite different. we will not even understand. Yeah. But that is the language. It is a language, Today not they dialect. They have yeah. it with it Gujarati, a... Bengali, and all that bringing in those words and we say this is the company and that is not the company that has become a dialect. Yeah. It's not correct. Hey, Saavad, Saavad. Saavad, Saavad. Saavad, 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 Ram Maro Magir Tinga, Gondo Pakar Rock, Magir Tinga, Sarma Muskar of my account, Gondo Pakar Rock, Magir Tinga, Bako, Magir Tunami, Mini Galo, Sora Bakar Rock, and that process soured. But I come at the Mundale. Come at Mulami, come at Muller, the Gallif of the Dual Gorte come at Mundale. Antiga would put it to the hand, come tuck, girl, Kodo, Tore, come tuck, girl, Kodo. Kamatu mal kodan puro tar kamat mula specific word for clean up cheeses. Ah. Saur mula entire process. Maaj tum gawa dae lo, ti tum gawa sabale condition dae le, ti tum sabale kastha dae le, sabale dae le. Saur. Ye aaj hi mar pata the ni saur man shabd. To maadang kya galpak. Tor kapsa. Saur. 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 Kya angi lata? Am maada aaj hi saur lata ni saur. 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 I mean, we have to put a 
and uh, proud of their roots, then only this is possible. Even uh, when we started tribal festival, uh, or when we started the Ordaasi Adivasi Sangatna campaign, there had to be very low keynote. There was very few youth participations. Now they are, because we are constantly going to the villages, we are uh, making them aware about the importance. So it will take time. If they become conscious, if they become uh, uh, proud the, of their roots. But not to restrict to a particular community, but to take it to the masses. Like, anybody who is interested in art or craft to take it forward. You want, uh, Why the owner should be only on that community? No, even, even uh, in the tribal, at the tribal festival, we give demonstration of giving uh, uh, San, Mala, uh, even uh, wearing out, we teach them to wear our saris. Uh, we, there is a special store we keep to give demonstration. We can learn no issue. But if someone wants to learn, no, we can help. give demonstration. We can help. We, can have help. we can have no issue. So there are some people who are interested in learning the mallas, how to make. We can. We have. Still we have got. We, uh, we have. Still we have got manpower to learn. Which to month? Teach. Which month is your festival? Uh, in the month of second, second, second Sunday, Sunday of January. Dateli. 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 But there can be specific reason why we don't get it. Because we don't get caught on the side. 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 Okay. What, excuse me, what jobs do they do now? You said you've migrated from the south and a lot of people have come in this area. What kind of jobs are you doing? Basically, drivers are educators. In Salset, even now, those who have migrated, migrated see, now outside why they are coming over here? Because we are not accepting any labor job. Outside are coming in Goa and to the menu. Similarly, even uh, those who have migrated in Diwar, in uh, North Goa, because of labor. Even still people are migrating to North Goa, some of our people. People do labor work. In the, agriculture. Agriculture. In the, in the uh, coconut plantation, who are other property field. John, it's not that uh, the work has not been done, but it's scattered all over the place. Uh, there is a book written by Antonio Costa, Prime Minister of Portugal's father, Orlando Costa, called Sinio de Ira, The Sign of Wrath, which is set in the Gauda community of uh, Tansanzor, where Chogli College is now. Okay. And uh, it's set in the 60s, but it uh, wasn't much appreciated for obvious reasons, because uh, he, he was a leftist and uh, he's quite sympathetic to that, he was to that reality. But no, even, even uh, we were not tolerable. But uh, mm -hmm. when uh, the Sutras from the Catholic community, when they went on ship, labor, shortage of labor was so that the tolerable people was taken over by us. Initially, we were not tolerable. So, road building was quite big because even the contractors were Gauda, like, yeah, like, from, uh, from like former MLA, former MLA. Uh, 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 not even before Anton Gaukar, this uh, MLA. Luis. Louis, Louis, Louis Mamakar, Louis Mamakar. Most of the uh, contractor from Salset and they used to hire labor from Amavali or from wherever the, there is Gauda located. So in the mines also at one stage? Yes. Even there are so many uh, songs uh, related to mining. That was when mining was very uh, not mechanized. Ma manually, manually, manual, manual mining. Even my, my mother there is so many stories, uh, stories about mining. Then, uh, Shifting cultivation, they used to go by walking, even in Kale, even in 20-20 kilometers, they used to walk. 
then work over there. Uh, Dr. Claude has published a book, one chapter of which is by Anita Haladi, who talks about uh, the Gauda community being pushed out first to the less fertile areas by more recent settlers Certainly. and other caste, and then after being pushed out from there also by developmental projects post 61. See, being first settler, settlements take place where the first settlement takes place where the land is fertile and availability of water. Now, the land which were, which have been developed by these first settlers might have been taken over by the migrants who have come first and they might have been pushed and survival, they have developed the land. And uh, these are the community efforts because uh, I can find uh, not big, big patch of patch of land, small, small, because community used to, together they used to develop the land. Small, small patch, 100 square meter for one person, 100 square meter for another person, 50 square meter for another person at one place. Advocate that uh, Bernadette Gomes has done a thesis on the ethno-medical uh, practices of the Kunbis of Baradi, but uh, she has uh, not published it. Okay, okay. Bernadette Gomes. Bernadette Gomes. Uh, Sociology professor. Yes, yes. Professor of retired. Government college campaign. Yeah, early retirement. Yeah. Even, uh, they have vast knowledge about all medicines, including uh, kidney stone, including uh, uh, stone problem. Uh, including the bone problem. Sorry, John Dishman. Yeah, lot of these traditional medicines are on a display for locals, so I can't understand. Even in, in too small kid, uh, note, they are being displayed at our tribal cafe also. Most probably, this thing must have got documented in BMC in the wider. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. There, is, there is work going on that. Yeah. So we have done it. Uh, Land use patterns, which are the oil. Land is better, no? Land is better. 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 बांधी भी डाला कर दस्ते। अतः नॉर्मली हमें लें जो ही अवेलेबिलिटी ऑफ वाटर के में सब ठीक है बगली करो प्रॉप अने अवेलेबिलिटी ऑफ वाटर सुविधा आती है सुविधा रोका था दौड़ पड़ा सब तो तुम क्या लोग उधर जोड़ जोड़ आस्था नहीं जाए ना कुछ तक क्या कहा स्लोपी जाए पाकोड़ा सब स्लोपाची so much more than that, that's why we have to do it. But it is God and God. We have to do it, 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 we have to do it. Concept of private property may have not been a Gauda part of the Gauda. Normally, we believe in community. And if you want to do it, 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 you want to do it. You want to get some other sound, I'll make you do that alone. I need to go to Nala Pura at alone. I need to go to Sarabati at alone. I need to go to Kashi at alone. But it's much more than entire service at my contract at alone. But it is basically beliefs in community welfare. But it's Kaza and Jasta at the end of the day. I need to get out of here. Kashi is basically a shopping at Kashi Barba. I need to cover the other thing. I need to go to Kashi. I want to say that there's a token of appreciation for you. I would ask our friend from Chikali, Cyril Fernandez, please hand over the... He's asking you. He's asking you. The hand over. Formality. Senior, senior Muniz. Please, he's asking.
speaker up. <laughs> oh. So on behalf of this, all the people who have come here, this is a token of appreciation for a wonderful job. Much of your success and whatever you are doing for the Gaudas community. I hope something different will take place. Thank you. And hopefully at time now, in the one three star most people. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.